Hey guys, welcome back to CNC Life. We are in our backyard. It is a beautiful morning out. Jackson's having a little picnic out here. He's having a picnic with his <laughs> coconut water. He loves this coconut water so much. I mean, he loves coconut drinks, water more than me. One hander, one hander. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I think I'm that's your sure you, coconut I'm water sure now. You washed back into it. Already. Thank you though for being so. This is sweet. my coconut water. He took it from me. Yeah, coconut water does not fly by Jackson. He always wants our coconut water. But anyways, I hope you guys are having a great day today. Look at my Cece girl. Beautiful. But you know what's going on with these dogs right now? They're shedding. I think because it's like their winter coat. I already Art. plucked her earlier, but they, she has like they both have like clumps of hair coming out them. Ooh, look at Arlo. Look. I, he comes over here. Look at that. All that white hair, that all needs to be plucked off his butt. He does not like being plucked off. <laughs> so we had to be more discreet about it. But look at all that. Yeah. Arlo, when we pluck him, he, he acts like we're torturing He's him. very... He's like, we're trying to help you out. He doesn't well, like it, but... Trying to help our house out. <laughs> Hi, Arlo. What are you doing? And he's not very hairy, but right here, all these clumps and clumps. Oh, yeah, grab him, grab him. I got his face over Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I tried to get as much as I could. Anyways, we're actually all ready for our day and we're actually headed to this really cool touch a truck event where I guess we can basically touch trucks. There's gonna be like tons of trucks at this church. And Jackson's, firefighter trucks, yeah. ambulances, um, police cars, police cars uh, construction whatever. cars, oh my goodness. We got like RVs, we got so much cool stuff. So, semis, and basically what we have to do is we have to go over there and basically just like, Carl, Jackson can actually go inside there and touch everything. Push which, the buttons and everything. Which he's never gotten to do before. So, we're actually headed to that event, we're really excited. I think Jackson will be so excited because everywhere we go, he's obsessed with cars, trucks, motorcycles, Everything. Polaris's. Polaris's, golf carts, you name it. So he's gonna like totally up his alley and we were not gonna miss it for anything. Jackson really wants to show you guys his new little toy here. Ooh. Get it. Oh man. Ready? Get it. Ooh. He goes crazy with this thing. Ooh, ooh. Just like daddy, huh? Get it, get it, get it. Ooh, ooh. Ooh. Ah. Oh, ooh. <laughs> These boys. Oh! <laughs> You're, crazy. You're so silly. Watch out, sweetie. You're oh, in the firing zone. <laughs> Whoa! It's like WWE in here. Okay, he's gonna go this way. Oh, wow. He's gonna keep doing it. Here he goes. <laughs> You're what literally he, crazy. He keeps doing it. I've never seen something so crazy. Here he goes. <laughs> High five. Oh, you need a little hug. I got you, baby. All right. Anyways, guy. now, what were you doing? Oh, yeah, whatever he wants. <laughs> that hurt? Whoa. Oh, wow, he's carrying it around. Where do you want to put it? <laughs> ah! Oh. <laughs> he's like getting it. No. He's trying to hit you guys. Uh, he's trying to hit you or... Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 Where's he going? Oh! What do you see, buddy? We see our first truck right here. What do you see, Jackson? Do you hear that? <laughs> Look at this dude. What is that? Do you see the truck? There's too many trucks. You don't even know what to go to, right? It's too much of a dream come true, huh? <laughs> You finally get to touch him. You don't know which to go to. He's such a stink. He's gonna go take it on though. He's okay. He's driving around, Jack. He's gonna drive the ambulance for us. Anyway. <laughs> Good boy, we are. <laughs> Look at the ambulance here. He's pushing all the buttons too. All right, it has been a long day outside. We're all exhausted. So we're actually inside and we're watching Jackson, Bluey. Jax is not exhausted. He wants to do it again. Yeah, look what happened to his nose, you guys. So earlier today on the trampoline, he was jumping around. He's like, I don't want to show Wait, you. let me see your nose. Earlier today, he was on that trampoline running around. Did we even get it on video? We might have got it on video when he well, scraped his face into the trampoline from jumping around with that thing. Oh yeah, whatever he wants. <laughs> Oh yeah, whatever he wants. <laughs> and yeah, now it looks like this. Uh, Got a nice little mark on your face. You wanna go outside, huh? 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> as soon as we start recording, he's like, I want to go outside. Go outside again. Uh, so anyways, he got that scrape on his face. He's really fine. Like, Here. he's totally fine. He's not even phased by it, actually. It doesn't even bother him. If anything, it just bothers me and like, my family. Everyone's like, what's wrong with his face? It looks like he got in a fight with the cement, but he didn't. Anyways, we're inside. I'm, like, exhausted. Like, I feel like I'm, like, abnormally exhausted from today. Like, I don't know what's going on, guys, but... I mean, I did go to the doctor a few days ago, or like a week ago. Like a week you ago. You went a week ago, but you got the results just recently. Yeah, I got the results recently, and I got a bunch of blood work done. Um, just for like more like an overall checkup. It wasn't because I went for any specific reason. I just went for an overall checkup. My blood work actually said a lot about how I'm feeling, I feel like. Um, which means that's good, because when you find problems, it means you can fix problems. <laughs> um, and we found out that I'm really low in a lot of stuff, which I feel like whenever I go to the doctor, I am always low in something. I'm, yeah. I'm always low in iron, or I'm, I'm low in blood sugar. Yeah. We found this out when yeah. you were pregnant with Jackson that you were just yeah. low on a bunch of stuff. Yeah, I'm always low in things. Um, but this time around, I'm not actually low in iron anymore. It's good. Good job, Cassie. <laughs> <laughs> but I am low in lots of other things. So I'm extremely low in... This one's really interesting. So we found out that I am super low in testosterone, which I've never been told that before. But I guess also I've never been tested for that before. Um, but that would explain a lot like for energy levels, I think. I'm also super low in vitamin D, which is not really that uncommon for people, but I'm like so low in vitamin D. Um, I don't know why, because I go outside literally all the time, but I don't think my body absorbs vitamin D very low, very well. I'm just low in uh, quite a few things, like progenolone, um, I'm low in folic, is that what it is? Is that what it's called? Folic? What is it called? Yeah, I'm low in folate. I'm, I have low folate, progenolone, um, geez, I don't know. My leptin is something too. Uh, yeah, so that was really interesting. Um, I think what would be cool is if we can, you know, fix those things. Maybe I could have, like, you know, be feeling a little bit better. Maybe we could make myself feel a little bit better. I haven't started anything to, like, fix any of that lately, um, yet at least. Um, I probably will, though, because that would be really interesting to see if I could have, like, a difference. So, yeah, that was just really interesting to get that blood work back. I wasn't expecting any of that. I was expecting, I'm always low in things, but it's always, like, something new it feels like. I go, you're low in iron, you're low in vitamin D, you're low in blood sugar. Oh, not anymore, now you're low in this and that and that. Um, I don't know why I'm low on things. Um, actually, some of these will explain actually maybe why I have a hard time with my weight and that maybe it, um, if I could get these levels figured out that I could maybe have an easier time losing weight. Um, that'd be really interesting too. Not that I am like that insecure about my weight, but I have noticed that it has been harder for me to manage it than it ever has before in my in like in my life. So anyways, that was just interesting. Let me know if you guys have ever been low in any of those kind of things. I thought that was really interesting information I've been given. All right, we are upstairs. We're actually all showered and ready for bed. We're watching a little bit of Toy Story. Toy, Toy, Toy Story 4, though, which is like my least favorite Toy Story, I think, personally. Toy Story 4 is like where they lost me. Um, we're actually at the end of it. Jackson's just watching right now. <laughs> we actually brought his little uh, football thing up here. And he's basically doing the same thing here that he was doing on the trampoline. <laughs> I put his, his nuggets so it seemed safer on the trampoline though, didn't it? What are you nope. doing? Oh, wait, wait. Oh. <clears throat> what are you doing? Why are you bringing it over here? It's a punching bag, <laughs> but he's it? using it as a tackle. tackle. <laughs> he thinks it's a football player. All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end today's video. Hope you guys liked it. If you did, smash that thumbs up button, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.